Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a cleaning out your closet vlog slash switching out my wardrobe. So as of now, everything in there is obviously spring, summer clothes, and maybe a few winter, fall pieces. I'm really wanting to kind of just like work on my wardrobe and I think that's all part of the growth that I'm experiencing after college, right, and just growing. So I have some clothes here um, and then a lot more in my wardrobe directly behind me but the goal for today is to uh, remove all of my summer clothes from there maybe there's spring pieces get rid of all of those and um, pack them away as well as pick out some fall slash winter pieces that I think would be of use for me this year um, you know with me working from home there's not really much for me to have to wear. Um, so I'm wanting my wardrobe to reflect pieces that I feel like I'm going to wear. And also I, I want to eliminate a lot of the colors that I have in my closet. Going for some more neutral tone colors and just also some pieces that I think I could pair with other things. I'm just dragging in the rest of my clothes from the attic. And the goal here is to clean out my closet get rid of or pack away the summer clothes that I have and then replace those items with some fall slash winter items. But keep the consistency in mind. So I don't want to have like all these different colors going in there. I want to have like a nice neutral looking closet. And I know for the most part, I'm not going to be wearing a lot of these items. So it's going to be a matter of the things that I really need versus things that I want, um, like stuff like this. I used to wear a lot of these different color sweaters. Maybe I might keep it, I don't know, but let's start. So the things that I'm gonna place in my closet are gonna go on the clothing rack off to the side, and I'm just gonna gradually fill it up and then replace it with the items in my closet. So just fill and go, fill and go. So we'll find out what everything looks like, but I'm really going for like a neutral, just light and airy colors, um, which is going to be hard for me because I don't have a lot of those existing colors as as of now. I mean, I have some neutrals and stuff in there, some browns, but you know, in my younger days, child, I had a lot of different colors, um, but I'm growing out of those things now, right? Like I'm really leaning towards neutral tone, neutral colors, so. We are going to fill up the rack, like I said before, with things that are going to go into the closet and then get rid of everything in the closet, fold those clothes, um, and place them in my pack. So the first thing that I want to do is remove the items in my closet so that I can use the hangers for the fall clothing. Go ahead and do that. I just don't understand why I have this much clothes half of it I don't wear like what is this what what is this and why do I have it <sighs> like stuff like this I need to just give away because it does not bring me joy <sighs> do you guys have any suggestions for hanging up bags like you know when you have too many purses or you know like little bags I got this from my sister do you have any suggestions let me know crazy thing about this is that there's more clothes there's more clothes like this is really bad I need to just get rid of like a lot of this stuff and work on having a capsule wardrobe because this is crazy so in the very back of my closet I actually had some winter pieces in there because I knew you know, it really wouldn't be seen. So I have a few things, but um, I don't know if I don't know if they're gonna go back. So we'll see. I don't know if they're gonna go back though.
Okay, guys, so this is pure progress, okay? Like, I tried to cut down as much color as possible. I know eventually I'm going to have to just add, add on to my wardrobe as I go. But I really did get rid of a lot of stuff. I'm donating a lot of stuff, giving away a lot of stuff. Um, yeah. And so these are all the hangers that I have to use to hang up in the closet. Keeping it nice and neutral, the colors. And this is a combination of, Jesus Lord, skirts. There's some things with tags on it still, but that's okay. I'll take them off. That just lets you know I haven't been able to wear that much stuff this summer. Um, but there's a combination of pants, skirts, blouses, tops, sweaters in this section here. And then these right here are all of my blazers. Um, they honestly need to get dry cleaned, but NYPD, Lord have mercy. But um, these are just my blazers that I'm going to um, put into my closet. So really excited about that. And then this collection right here. <laughs> It's like a lot of the summer clothes that I decided to keep. Um, and I'm going to put it away in storage later. This is my collection that I'm going to donate, give away. Next on the agenda is my um, storage cubes. As far as my shoe goes, I have a lot of, um, I have, well, not really a lot, but I have some extra of those little storage containers from my storage cubes. So I'm just going to put them in those and possibly tuck them under the bed if they could fit or just store them somewhere else. But I think that's what I'm going to do because honestly, I could place them in storage containers, but there's just so many other shoes in there as it is. Yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and just store these shoes in these little storage cubes and hopefully I have enough for them. All right guys, so I already know I'm not gonna have enough cubes for these shoes, so I don't know. I'm gonna have to figure something else out for these shoes. But for now, let's do it. I guess I underestimated these boxes because they all fit besides my sneakers but I need those so I'm happy all right guys so I'm slowly going to add on to this rack the things that I'm going to place back into my closet um so yeah I'm just going to casually grab some stuff from my bed and then place them on this rack and then transfer them over to my closet so that I can see exactly what I need to place in the closet so this is just a quick pan of the first set of clothes that's going into the closet. I'm already deciding not to put some of these other things in there, like this. But I don't know, we'll see. It might go in, honestly. I'm really just trying to keep some sort of a cohesion with the colors. And, you know, my jeans, they have to stay. Those are just necessary. But as far as the consistency of keeping my neutral colors. I think I'm doing a decent job. So we'll see what I end up leaving out. So 
So these are the blazers I'm going to keep for the fall, winter. So yeah, I would definitely consider these blazers that I could dress up and make it like a casual wear um, since I'm not gonna be in the office. Although I would wear these blazers to work, but I feel like I can also dress them up with some jeans or pants. So another thing is that I actually thrifted every one of these, each and every one of these um, blazers. They were probably all under $12. So that's that. So this can go back in here. Oh, it's a little heavy. Oh God. All right, and this is my like t-shirt drawer. Oh, they're mainly college t-shirts. College t-shirts, free t-shirts, and some more t-shirts. Can't get rid of those for the free ski. And then I have some pants in here. And workout pants. All right, all my shoes. Now, honestly, I can put them back in there for now because I mean it's still warm. You know, you never, you never know. You might show your toes. And I'm not ready to pull out my winter shoes yet. So for now, I'm gonna place these bad boys in here. Yes. I just love. Everything looks nice, clean and put together. Um, this is my like makeup slash miscellaneous box. So I'm gonna put that back over here where I had it next to my laundry bin. Whew. Wow, you guys, I just cannot believe I did this. And over here is the bag of clothes I'm going to either donate or try to sell. Maybe, I don't know, coronavirus and everything, but it's a pretty big bag. Ta -da! I cannot believe this. Like, this is. Um, so, yeah, I'm just really happy with how this turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me, let me know what you guys think in the comments below with how I achieved the, um, cohesiveness in my color scheme and I really just like got rid of a lot of colors like you could tell from the before um pick in the before footage you know I definitely got rid of a lot of stuff but I'm so happy fall is just such a great time you know it's just so yeah really happy about that but don't forget to like comment and subscribe and share this video if you care I appreciate you guys for watching thanks bye